Hey, hey, hey! Hi, everyone! Hello! How y'all doing? Good to see y'all on YouTube. Hello. Ooh, my earphones are so tangled. Or not tangled, but they're like... You know how they get like twisty after a while? And then you have to like untwist them. There we go. Hey everyone! Exciting stream today because... <clears throat> Look what I got! Oh, I'm so excited! It's like my birthday all over again! <laughs> I'm so excited! That'll be today's stream. Hey everyone, hello. Can I pin this? Let me see. I'm trying, but I can't. For some reason, I don't get any. It's like, uh, there's something weird about streaming to YouTube. I can't actually change anything in the chat from where I am. I have to like go to my own thing in the browser. Isn't that weird? Um, let's see, now I'm in the browser. Can someone, um, oh, wait, actually, I can do two. <laughs> a room. I should do it. I think. <laughs> there it is. Okay, so then I do this and I pin. Did that work? Yeah, awesome. <laughs> Beautiful, beautiful. I did it. Okay, and it works. Awesome. We are set. There we go. Hi, everyone. Hello, hello. Yes, very, very exciting stream today. So, Fireproof Games, um, I'm, I'm guessing all of you know who they are. They make the room games, some of my favorite games. I really, really like them. They're so good, and they're not only good on PC. They are they play really well on iOS, well and as well and on Nintendo Switch. Um, I I really love those games. If you don't know them, I have playthroughs of every game except the VR game on my channel. Um, we will be playing some of the Room One again today for fun. So the funny thing is that they they came to me and were like. The room is 10 years, can we like send you some goodies? Um, could we potentially sponsor you for like playing the game a little bit? And I was like, you do know I've played them, right? Like there's like whole videos on my channel of the games and they were like, yes, and we love them. And I'm like, oh, that's so nice. So really, really cool. I can't wait to see what's in the box. I know of one thing in the box that I'm excited to do. A little hands-on exercise today. Oh yeah, this is my other mug that I got. <laughs> so I got two new mugs recently. And uh, one was the pink and blue cute little clouds mug. And then this one is just like a regular black mug that they also had. I really like it. I like them. I do a big sippy. <laughs> <laughs> What's in the box? Um, but yeah, if you haven't played the room games and you like puzzle games, I really recommend them. They work, um, they're on iOS, Android as well, and they work really well. Like, you, everything's like touch screen to like turn the cam and like you turn little keys and stuff. It's really nice. I have it actually, I bought it on the Switch as well because I just like playing them. And on the Switch, it also just works with the touch screen. Really nice. How's BB? He's doing a little better. I think the diabetic food, like he hasn't been getting his shots yet because we, we haven't had our class yet, but um, like just with the food, he seems to be a little bit more like less tired because he didn't really want to come up the stairs anymore or like jump up high. But today uh, and last night, he's just been like coming upstairs and <laughs> jumping on like high stuff so it seems like he's getting some of his energy back which is cool very happy with that 
Yeah, BB got diagnosed with diabetes. He is now diabetes. Um, it was a really hectic week, but um, yeah, we're... So I did the whole story on Twitch yesterday, so I won't do the whole story, but basically we had... BB seemed a little off, so we took him to the vet, and turns out he has diabetes, but we caught it so early that the vet isn't worried at all. Um, they just gave us advice, like put him on the best diabetic food, and we I had to order a glucose monitor for cats, and once that comes in the mail, I think tomorrow, then I'm gonna call them and we're gonna book a one hour class to learn how to take BB's glucose levels, how to measure them and how to give him insulin shots. And there's basically three ways it can go from here. Either he'll have diabetes for the rest of his life, which doesn't impact his lifespan if we take care of him properly. So should be like, he should still be able to grow old. Um, but either we give him insulin shots for the rest of his life um, and he's just a happy, stable beep. Or because uh, we caught it so early, he might not need shots anymore in a couple months, which would be amazing. And then we'll keep him on the diabetic food. Or the diabetes goes completely in remission and he's fine after a couple months. But that's like, that's like really lucky best case scenario. So I'm not getting my hopes up, but... Um, I am totally prepared to give BB two shots a day for the rest of his life for like the next 10 years <laughs> So we'll see but yeah, that that's um, that's gonna happen soon. I'm, go I'm hoping I can go to the vet tomorrow But I need to wait for that glucose monitor to arrive But yeah, it's one of those things where it's like There's not really a clear reason why cats get diabetes um it could be the fact that he's a bit older. It could be the fact that he's an indoor cat, so he doesn't get as much exercise as an outdoor cat. It could be the fact that he was slightly overweight earlier in his life. It could be the fact that he's neutered and a bit older and a male. Apparently it happens more for male neutered older cats. So it's like, yeah. It could be a lot of things. Or maybe they all contributed. I don't know. BB's eight now. He's grown into a very old man with two shots a day. Yes, that's the dream. Um, he's a little weak right now. Like you can tell he has a little bit of like weak, wet, weak back legs, but um, that should totally stable out once we get like the right amount of insulin down and stuff. Yeah. I'm doing pretty good. I went to see an uh, osteopath today. Have you guys heard of that? I think it's an osteopath. I think that's the word. Uh, I can't Google it. Osteopath. There we go. Osteopathy. Um, emphasizes physical manipulation of the body's muscle tissue and bones. So, basically, it's it's kind of like getting massaged, like a physiotherapy massage, but it's like a little bit more with like, um, like she, I had like a lot of rhomboid pain, so between your shoulder blades, uh, recently. So she kind of like presses and then then like pulls your arm and rotates, so like the muscles get manipulated. And it's given me a little bit of a headache because I think it's a lot of like, because I have a lot of tension in my neck and my shoulders. So now that that's been like massaged, my, my body's kind of like, oh, okay. <laughs> but it was, it was pretty good. So, and she complimented, uh, she complimented my upper body muscles. She was like, I can tell that you've really worked on like upper body strength over the years and like you have good core strength and... Um, she also actually complimented the chiropractor who's been massaging me before. She was like, they have done really good work around your shoulders and stuff, because she could tell that they've been, like, loosened up already. Um, so I was like, huh, interesting. How did it go with your new tattoo? Oh, it's totally fine. 
Yeah, the t tattoo is totally healed now. You do have to hydrate after massages. I haven't... This is my second cup of coffee. Yeah, maybe... Oh, you're that... You're like that boyfriend that's like, Babe, did you have enough to drink? Did you drink your water? And I'm like, no. <laughs> I should maybe get some water, yeah. But I also have coffee. Oops. Water is vital after massage. But water is so boring. Ooh, maybe I'll put some like electrolyte powder in it. That'll make it a little tastier. Um, yeah, I'll get some water. And then I'll be back. Hydration station. I got water and I put um, electrolytes in it that has a lot of potassium in it. Now I just gotta wait for it to dissolve. That should help. From the Netherlands. Hello, Nederland. Who had it there? Did her interactive send the poster? No, I bought it. Potassium? Yes, potassium. I don't know if it actually helps, but apparently we need a crazy amount of potassium in a day. Um, and most people don't get it, including me. Does it taste okay? Yeah, this tastes nice. I like this one. I don't usually drink electrolyte powder stuff anymore because there's always um, citric, acid, uh, citric acid in it. So it gives me acid reflux. What poster? Oh, that one. This one here in the back. Jamie, thanks for becoming a member. Thank you. 
Potassium is great for muscle soreness. Oh, what your cells use is energy. Do 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 do. So how are you guys doing? What's the plan for today? Getting ready for the weekend? Oh yeah, coconut water. Yeah, that's true. That's a good natural one. Oh yeah, this is tasty though. So easy to drink. Oh, I can't put my thing here. Okay. Are you guys ready to open the box? Should we do it? Should we see what's inside? Um, I do have a couple of talking points for today because it is a sponsored stream. Um, so not only did they send me a couple goodies to unpack today, um, but yeah, it is sponsored today as well to let you guys know that because of the 10th anniversary, for the 10th anniversary, the games are basically on sale almost everywhere. Um, the Nintendo Switch Edition has 80% off in the US, 85% off in the UK. So that's a lot. So you can get them real cheap right now until September 22nd. Um, they're on sale on Steam. They're on sale on the Google Play Store. So you can get them anywhere. Big sale time. Um, but yeah, we are gonna open the goodie box. Oh, it's so big. I gotta be real careful I don't knock over this coffee. Okay. Hallelujah! The gods have sent me goodies. Okay, I need to take these off because they're just so in the way. There we go. Uh. Okay. Don't get into anything. Okay, I also actually prepared a cool camera angle. I guess I could use it already. I was gonna use it for later. I gotta, ooh, gotta be careful. <laughs> Look what I did. Ta-da, this is my desk. <laughs> because I already see it. The room. I'm gonna make a Lego today. <laughs> it's so cute. Look at the little guy. <laughs> He's so cute. <laughs> okay, so we have a cool little Lego that we're gonna definitely do in detail. Oh, thankfully this is saved already because, or solved already, because I can't do these. Can you guys do Rubik's cubes? I'm so, oh, oh, I'm scared to even mess it up now because it's like, it's it's solved. So now I can pretend that I solved it. I I have no idea how they work. Uh, we got a really cool notebook. That's really nice. He's gold. Oh, even the side is gold. Pages. Ah, it's just a lined one. Nice. Very chic. This is the box. You see that it's. Oh, well, you can't really. The camera's too good. It's like fixing it, but it has one of those. Oh, yeah, there, there. You can see it. It's like when you use the lens, like the things that show up. Ooh, a tarot deck. Awesome. We were just talking about tarot cards yesterday. Ooh, they're really fancy. That's so cool. Look at that fancy camera. Sanctuary. Temple. No, the null, the null element. 
knowledge. Dude, these could be framed. They're so cool. <laughs> Death. And the back is this, by the way. Cosmos. Voyage. Escape. Uh, remember when we got these endings? Was that the room three? I want to say three. We got like the boat escape ending and stuff. Imprisoned. Lost. Ooh, release. It is three, yeah. Gray home. Origins. The Void. I think they're in the first game as well, right? Isn't there a seance room in the first game? Where you use cards? Isolation. Damnation. Cool. Reflection. Illumination. Navigation. Dude, these are so cool. God, I feel so spoiled. Um, I asked, by the way, if any of these goodies were for sale or were going to be for sale. And I don't think they're planning to, but if there's a lot of interest for it, then they might consider it. So definitely reach out to them if you want, like, the cards or the Lego set for yourself. Because then if they get, if they're, if they get poked by enough people, they might, like, make them available. Because these are really, really cool. I feel so lucky. <laughs> uh, I should, probably should have looked at the card first. <laughs> Can you believe it's been a whole decade since Fireproof Game unleashed the room? Fireproof Games unleashed the room and ignited the flames of a legendary puzzle series. While we're busy celebrating and blowing out the candles on the 10th anniversary cake, we thought we'd create a special surprise for you. We've conjured up some exclusive collector's merchandise to commemorate this milestone and we're bursting with excitement to share it with you. The true connoisseur of the extraordinary. So here's to a decade of mystery, intrigue and mind-bending puzzles. We hope you enjoyed this treasure trove of limited edition goodies. That's so nice. <laughs> I think that's it. Oh, a pen has the room on it. <laughs> Can't make sure I don't miss anything. Oh, I did miss something. Fireproof Games pin and the null element pin. Good thing I checked. Okay, now I think I got it. Oh, God, carefully close the box. Yay! Ugh. Lego time. <laughs> it's so cute. I want to see the little guy. <laughs> Ta da da da! This is definitely, we're gonna make the Lego and then I'll put it behind with my other goodies. For sure. Mysterious safe. Exclusive limited edition. Wow, that's so cool. The games. Adventure awaits. Lego awaits. Okay, I'll put that there. Let's see what we have. I don't think they're marked. Nope. Where's the little guy? Ah, there he is! <laughs> I guess we have to put him together, but... Uh, you see a little face in there. <laughs> okay. We're gonna start with these. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me put my music back in. I want some lo-fi beats to get me in the focus zone. I haven't done much Lego. I made like the, the NES model thing. Looks like custom package. Yeah, because it is limited edition, right? 
So we need to put two of these together. Oh yeah, I need to like... What's it called again? When you like, um... When you want to put everything out and organize it by size. Knolling, right? It's knolling. Like before you make anything, you want to like put everything out. Organized. I need two big ones. Okay, I need corner pieces. Oh, maybe these. Oh, these are corner pieces. Knolling, yeah. So, knolling is like I have this whole bag of Legos that I now just threw on my desk. So, I'm gonna be like, okay, these pieces all need to go together. Before I start building, I wanna have everything organized. That's knolling, apparently. My brother told me when we made the NES Lego. That we have a lot of brown pieces. Bing, bing, bing. Okay, so I need two of these. Can you guys see everything okay? You can, right? Isn't that cool? Now that I have this set up, I might be able to do like jigsaw puzzle streams or something as well. Maybe get a different um, camera arm so we can put it more like above than this is like a side view. Doo -doo -doo. That would be so cool. Yeah. Dude, I cannot believe this is a sponsored stream. Isn't that nuts? This is like a match made in heaven. It's like a game I absolutely adore. And then they're just like... No, we love your videos. Please. <laughs> Have a Lego. <laughs> there we go. One more. And then these guys. Can you see the Virgo in me? Is my Virgo shining right now? <laughs> okay. So we have these two, and we put these on the corners. So I need one, two, three, four, five, six, six long pieces. Are the are these six long? Yeah. So we're gonna put these on. Okay, that was step one. <laughs> I did it! Step one. I need two of these. This is hard to see. Don't know where the cutoff is. Oh yeah, so they put these here. And then a two-piece there, but I don't have a two-piece yet. These- Oh, there's a little newspaper! <laughs> There's a little newspaper piece. <laughs> so cute. Um, actually, these are a lot of tiny pieces. Maybe I should leave them in the in the bag because I don't have that much real estate on this table. Okay, then. Oh, okay, another one of these. Here. Oh, two. I think I'm a slow Lego builder. Are you guys, because my brother, I guess because I'm used to my brother, my brother's a huge Lego fan. Um, and he, He's done so much Lego throughout his life that when we did the NES thing together... Let me see if it's actually in here. Oh! Um, like, I was just like taking my time knowing, and he was just like, 
He's like one of those doctors performing surgery and he's just like, scalpel. <laughs> Give me a brown six piece. <laughs> Okay, so we need a little a little brown piece with a nubbin for the end. And I don't see it. Oh, here's one. Come to me, little brown piece. Yes. Okay. There. I'm doing it. Oh yeah, I also am like, I'm just like, okay, they're in, right? And it's fine by me. But see how this isn't like a straight 90 degree angle? My brother would like, with his nail, like push them exactly right. And I was like, oh, so now they're perfectly straight. <laughs> he taught me things. Okay, next page. I'm doing the thing. <laughs> okay, two more of these. And one two piece. You know, do you think I should have done it? Yep. I now see the dividing line between these two black ones and that this actually should be here. I should probably redo that. But how do you get them off? Oh, there's things for that, right? You have like those Lego things that... It's like a beer opener, but for Lego. Good thing I caught it now though, instead of halfway through the whole thing. So they're gonna go here. There. Okay, this is complicated. Sitting on my bar at home. Oh, I'm having a little drippy. So tiny and cute. <laughs> a brick separator, yes. That's what it is. Okay. These went in like that. Contrary to what this looks like, I am a fast puzzler. <laughs> but I am not a fast Legoer. Not a fast Lego builder. Okay, now how am I gonna get this one difficult one out of the way? Tell me how! There, I got it. Okay. First, this one. Maybe that's why they did it like that. Okay, now they're connecting. Yeah! Connecting bridge. What? Oh yeah, now it's the- Oh, there, right, this thing. So this thing comes at the end here. Tell me how I built this Lego. Okay, and then it's the two piece are there. And these go on this side. Okay, we got this. There. I wonder if my brother's gonna text me any minute being like, Yo, you doing Legos? I see you live! And I'll be like, yes. And I'm the only one who has this. Well, and whoever else got the... I don't know how many they made, how many Lego sets. Yo, dog, you build Legos? Hell yeah, I am. One there, tall boy in the middle, jelly brother, yeah. My brother, yeah, my brother does a shit ton of Lego. He came over for a week one time 
think it's like last year. Um, and I was like, I'll make sure he has a good week. So I bought a couple Legos. And we we did Legos and we played like Mario Brothers and stuff. Like the old ones, the NES ones. Um, he had a good week. Oh, there's nothing here. Hmm. Oh wait, actually, they're kind of red. I think it's these. Can you tell? I don't know if you guys can see, but... Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see that, but the, the nubbins, the colors are slightly off. But it's hard to see, I think. It's even hard to see for me. Okay. More of these. Kind of red, yeah. Ah, okay. Then we're on the same page. Good. Which part am I doing? Oh, this one. <laughs> I'm always so terrified that I'm doing something wrong that I double check everything. Oh, are we making the we're making the wooden floor? I now realize. That's so cool. You can tell I'm easily impressed. Wow, I'm getting to make a wooden floor. That's so cool. There you are. This one goes here. And then two more big ones. I'm so excited to see it come together. Like the actual box. I want to make the little dude. <laughs> That'll be fun. Okay, three of these. So here. There. Getting a little risky now. And here. Starting to see the pattern. So, what y'all's doing today? Except for your stream. What are you? What are you doing next to the stream? What's? What are you playing? Why are you watching? Well, I guess you're watching this, but what's the plan for today? Working, reading, going to bookstore. Ooh, bookstore! You just check in new releases. Homework? Uh, yeah. Well, it's an essential part of life, isn't it? That work enjoying the show? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you, before the end of the stream, I'm expecting my brother to text me, being like, Yo! That Lego looks sick! <laughs> How come you didn't tell me you got a custom Lego? After this, I will be sleeping. It's midnight. Oh, so late. That's time zones for you. Going to a new fantasy book launch. Ooh, which author? Mentally preparing for the start of my last year of college. Ooh, that's exciting. Yeah, I know. That's really stressful in the moment, but... Ooh, we're doing something different here. <laughs> One... One big one. But then we have a four parter and a three parter. Um oh here. So I think it's this one and this one at the end. And I need another nubbin. This one. There. Okay. Catching up on Ahsoka. Oh yeah, Sean started watching that, but... I... Apart from, like, the main episodes 1 to 6, um, I don't really like most of the Star Wars stuff. I've, I've heard the Clone Wars are really good. There! I did it! 
floor. And now these will be along the edges. Oh, you know what? Those red nubbins are for the, the puzzle box to lock into later, I think. Okay. I watched Pretty Predator again. That's why I said turn around. I love Predator so much. There. Ooh, we need a special one. Oh, I don't have that one yet. Okay, let me just finish the other side first. This one. these one of these and now I need to find whatever this is in the middle you know next time I oh, no that's not it if I ever do like a puzzle stream I should probably get my nails done shouldn't I <laughs> I have like the most the most normie nails like, I haven't even bothered filing them. Hmm. Where are you hiding? That will be fun though. I like- I like getting my nails done. I love pedicures more. Pedicures are my favorite. But for special occasions, it's fun to get your nails done. Uh, hmm. Oh, these are thick boys. <laughs> this is gonna be so exciting. Where is it though? Yeah, these are all thick boys. Oh, I'm looking down a lot. Oh. Okay. Hard to find. Because it's basically. Oh, wait. <gasps> I might have it. It might be in this one. Don't spill everywhere. Is it this? Yeah, I found it. Such a weird piece. <laughs> a little exhaust pipe <laughs> for the floor. Okay. It's like a mini chair. <laughs> Nails done, you mean with gel? No, just nail polish. I like getting it getting them filed and polished. I, I can polish my own nails. I'm not too bad at it, but it definitely will never be as clean a job as getting it done. Okay, we're gonna start the the box now. So we have these. I think we're just putting them on top of each other, right? Looks like it, yeah. That is very... Oh, that's so satisfying. <laughs> they don't really... Oh yeah, now, now they're... I had to like f press every side to really get it to fit. Okay. Um, let's see. I need one of these tiny boys. I feel like such a grandma when I'm like... <laughs> what are the instructions? Let me see. Where do I put this tiny Lego? Oh, there, okay. <laughs> and now I'm like actually seriously like, I think it goes. <laughs> Grandma does like a good Lego every now and then. 
you guys watch the... Oh, I don't know if I can actually... I was gonna, I was gonna talk about other games, but I guess I, I shouldn't with a sponsor deal. This one. Ooh. Special round boy coming in. And a six nubbies one. There you are. Cool. Ooh, it's time for thick boys. I think it's time to knoll again. I don't really like this mess that I've created. The music is a bop. This reminds me of um, the countless hours I've spent at my grandmother's puzzling. And one of my things, one of the things that I really enjoyed doing was other people were puzzling and then they'd be like, I just can't find this one piece. Look here, it should be like half blue, half white or whatever pattern. And then I would go over all the pieces and I would just be like, there, I got you. <laughs> But yeah, I would, um, we would go to my grandparents, both of my grandparents' um, interns every Sunday. And one of my grandparents always had a puzzle out. Always. I, I will definitely turn into that kind of grandmother if I ever do. I will always make sure I have a puzzle on a table for kids. Melts their little brains, you know? Oh, you want a cookie? You gotta work for it. Finish this puzzle. Bish. Get cooking. Okay, there. That's better. Yeah, <laughs> look at this little letter. <laughs> it's so cute. Ah, fuck. Oh yeah, these are not the same as from the other bag. These are flat top. We're gonna hook these in like this. There. A little newspaper. Oh, there's two newspapers! <laughs> okay. Oh! Uh... Oh, okay, 10 minutes to 4. I need to feed BB at 4. So let me just finish knolling and then I'll go feed BB. My little diabetic boy needs precise... needs to be fed at precise times. Um, but yeah, I, th I definitely think I like puzzling because I loved those Sundays. Um, I loved going to my grandparents. Obviously, I mean, who... I mean, I'm sure there's exceptions, but most people probably really enjoyed going to their grandparents when they were younger because it's when you get, like, sweets and cookies and... Um, but what I always liked the most was that one of my grandmothers always had a puzzle on the table and I... I would just be left alone, puzzling for hours, also fixing my grandma's mistakes. She couldn't see that well. Um, so she, sometimes she would just like, she would just like force a piece in, like being like, that should go there. <laughs> that should go there, damn it. <laughs> and I would just go over it with my tiny child eyes that could see perfectly and be like, but those don't match. I would like go over her puzzle and fix her mistakes. But yeah, I loved just being left alone for a whole hour puzzling. Okay. Are you guys happy with my knolling job? <laughs> Let me just quickly give BB some food and then I'll be back. Um, it should only take like a minute or two. Be right back. Thank you. 
good Wait. okay I um had to explain to my the osteopath that I went to this morning that I did too many puzzles recently because it always leads to rhomboid pain for me oh. it's like right between your shoulder blades like attached to your spine it really starts to hurt. It's like the same now. I think because I start to like kind of like hunch when I do this kind of stuff. <sighs> okay. But yeah, I told her I was like, I've been puzzling a little too much lately. At least to a lot of back pain. Puzzle goblin, yeah. I just need to like sit back a little bit. <clears throat> okay, thick boy time. And that's not the right bag. I need this like corner piece. Ah, here they are. They're in this one. Let's expand their business. <laughs> Terror! Panic! There, these are round boys in these parts. Gotta be careful. Don't go anywhere. Okay. I got it. I need two. So, they go here. Okay. She did show me a, a rhomboid stretch though, that I didn't know, where you put, you put your elbows like here, and you interlace your fingers, like just below your neck, and then you like push your elbows, squeeze them together. Oh, so nice. Gonna do that a lot, I'm sure. There. Okay. Yeah, we are doing Lego. I know this is... I've, we've never done anything like this before on the channel. Like, creative streams like this. Um but it was the perfect excuse for me because I I do wanna, like I've been thinking about doing puzzle streams and stuff. And like just chill together and just make little things. I think I need this one. Like that. 
Yeah. Okay. And then I need another one. Oh, these are so tricky. They have like a little extra thing on, a little nubbin on the side as well. <sighs> now I need to be very careful that I don't use the wrong one. Huh! <laughs> Why is it so scary when I accidentally- I, I think it's scary because I'm worried that I'm gonna drop it and never find it. It's like dropping a puzzle piece and then you're just like, I have no idea where that went. I need a little sight nubbin, please. Where are you? My phone just buzzed being like, did you remind, did you feed BB? I sure did, he was very happy. Oh, there's also these pieces that have like a hole in them. <sighs> okay, I can't find it. These are solid ones. This is a weird one. Solid ones. Side ones. Side nub in action. Regular. 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 Hole. There's also these that have like a little arm on it. Hmm. I'll find it eventually. I mean, process of elimination. I do really love these kind of things. I fucking love puzzling. Lego and puzzling is very similar. To me at least. Oh, these have a hole in them. This... Here. Yeah, we must be getting closer because there's not that many pieces left. Side nubbin. Why did I put you there? You should go there. Solid piece. Side nubbin. Side nubbin. Side nubbin. Oh, did I find you? Yes, I found it. Okay, well now I'm this far, I need to finish it. <laughs> Grabby arm. Grabby arm, grabby arm. This is such a nice little texture on the side. Cool. If you see something rolling off the desk, let me know. <laughs> Look how many side nubbins I got. Wait, this is a this is a new one. This is a double side nubbin. There. Oh, lovely. Beautiful. Okay. So I did this. Now we need these. See, this is the power of Noling. Now I found these immediately. <laughs> Okay, I need these and these. Um, okay, so this goes there. I need the gold one. Ooh, gold piece. It's a gold bar. <laughs> you go there. And then these go here. And 
then one solid piece in the middle. Yes. Excellent, yes. Okay, I need these. Oh, these are red and brown. The color difference is so subtle. I don't think Sean would be able to see this. Because he's slightly... He can, yeah, he can tell. But he's like slightly red-green colorblind. I always forget and then suddenly he's like... Especially with like yellow and green. Sometimes he'll just be like... Yeah, the yellow thing. And I'm like, dude, that's green. That's totally green. red ones. Uh, now the big tower. Oh, that's so weird. And then flat boy. Flat boy, flat boy. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when I build on you? Ah! Ah! <laughs> Someone is watching right now, being like, maybe my brother, being like, what a Lego noob. She doesn't even rotate her pieces to be exactly 90 degrees. There. Okay. Uh, yeah, that looks good. I did it. Word, that was step 24. Okay. We're going to this side. I need a three piece. Here. Oh, the side nubbin. It's time for the side nubbin. Okay, and then a one, the one piece. I don't actually watch One Piece, by the way. It's too too long. Oh god, what is this? Look at these pieces. What is that? Oh, that must be custom for the room. It's like the it's the panels that you look through with the eyepiece. Stickers? No, they... they're blocks. At least it doesn't say that they're stickers. But yeah, I haven't seen... oh, maybe... let me check the stickers, yeah, maybe... Oh, it is stickers! Yeah, yeah, you're right! So it's that... those blocks with stickers on... oh, I'm gonna be bad at stickers. Cool. Custom. Oh god. Okay. So we're gonna do these and one of these in between. Wait, maybe I should put the sticker on before I put them together. Take him on straight. I know. There we go. Does it even fit? It doesn't even fit. The sticker is slightly bigger than the block. I guess I'll stick them together then. So I can slightly overlap with the middle piece. Yeah, there's no other pieces, right? Hmm. Stickers are the bane of my Lego assembly. Yeah. This shit's scary. Especially in a low lighting room. Maybe I 
I should align it with the side. I also have not, I don't have enough light in this room. Oh. Yeah, that's pretty straight. Judge my work. It's not straight. Don't look at it. I failed you guys. <laughs> mm. No, it looks kind of straight. It looks kind of straight. Let's just say it looks straight, okay? Because I don't do it again now. This is literally making me sweat. That's crazy. My sweat problem has been getting worse again lately. But I'm gonna try something new with the duck. So we'll see about that. We'll see about that. This is so hard. Because I want to do it perfect. I actually bought a sticker tweezer kit for like a model thing I'm doing. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> It's not perfect, but we're just gonna, we're just gonna be okay with this. <laughs> Poe buddy's nerfect! And I need a big tower. Good enough, right? Yeah. I, I would say so. Look, from that far away, you can't even- Oh, you can probably tell. Carrying on. Oh, I have to do it again. <laughs> There's more. <laughs> okay. Mm. Oh, one of these. Okay. And then three with the side nubbin. Yeah, good enough, right? Dude, my hands, my hands are made for video games, okay? Not for petite work. Oh, that's not where that goes. Oh, it is, it is. Oops. <laughs> my PC went into sleep mode for a screensaver. Dude, that is so not straight. Okay, I'm just gonna embrace the imperfection too hard. There we go. That's how we do it. Any sticker. Oh yeah, that short about the leg hair. Oh. Okay, this one has to go in the middle. That's tricky. That short about the leg hair got so much feedback. I didn't expect that. I didn't know it was such a big deal for people. Like, leg hair apparently is the topic where people are like, okay, here's my two cents. Oh yeah, I should do it from this side because the nubbins are like... a good... Ooh. Topic. Lots of discussion on the leg hair. Dude, why is this so hard? Fuck. Fuck. Stop. Stop. This sticker is so eager. Ooh, that's pretty good. Ooh. 
Dude. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. Um. Now we need tiny nubbins. Where'd you go? Where are you? Um, I need one of the flat ones. Oh, that's these. That one goes up top here. You know what's really impressive to me are the people, the Lego engineers, who like come up with these designs. Like they know exactly, like, okay, if you want to make something that looks like this IRL thing, we're gonna put it together like this and this, so and so. Oh, it's this, of course. And then that'll work. That's just amazing to me. Um, two parter. That would be such a cool job. Yeah. I'm surprised my brother didn't go in that direction, honestly. He, he is really, he's so good with Lego. He would actually do that. He's a big Formula One fan as well. And he would like, he would like look at pictures of Formula One cars and just build them out of the Lego that he had. Like actual like approximation it would actually look like a formula one car and i'd just be like that's fucking magic dude how do you do that okay um we're gonna turn we're gonna go in this direction there. one more and then one of these. Nope. I'm looking at the wrong thing. Oh yeah, I am looking at the wrong thing. Okay. I do need one of those. And then one of these. Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Now I need three of these. Where are they gonna go? Oh, I see. Let's go together here. That is not straight on at all. I'm learning how to like not press as hard. Getting a little better at it. Okay. And then one tall tower. There you go. That was step 30. Cool. Three more on this side, same thing. Nice, nice, nice. Another tower. Oh, it's a, the last tower. Okay. Let's see. Let's see here. So this side. Oh, this is gonna have to fit in the middle. Okay. <laughs> One side nubbin. Wait, how do we... How do we put that in? Hmm. Oh, it's not this one. Oh. These are different as well. It's this one different one. There we go. Okay. Then these come up. Need two flat ones. Oh, you love a good knoll. 
I love when I can find the piece that I need immediately. Okay, okay, okay. Good progress. I need a one... I need the one piece. Oh, these. Yeah. Wait, is it there? No, it's not there! Ah, take it back! It's here. Okay. Oh god, I need to do another sticker. <gasps> okay. Need to do another long boy. It me! In sticker form! Come on, boy. Oh, yeah, it's not straight. I was like, that was too quick. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's... Mm, I don't know if I can get it off without damaging it. Mm, I might just leave it crooked. Because I don't want to damage the sticker. I'm just going to look at the side anyway. Right? There. <laughs> it it doesn't really look like oh it's it's kind of starting to look like the the thing. <laughs> okay, put that on. The last four of these go on now. Right here. Virgos are fed up. I am a Virgo. I'm not fed up. Okay, that's that. Okay, ooh. ooh, what are we doing here? One there. Okay, two more stickers. Oh wait, should we put them together again? Yeah. So it's two of these, and then one of these in the middle. So entirely enjoying this. <laughs> I'm glad they like it. I'm just doing Lego and talking shit, really. Okay, now I need to put these bad boys on. This should be easier than Long Boy, at least. It's a little hard with the lighting. Yeah, that's good. I don't know how Sean does the Warhammer figurine painting. I could... I could probably do it if I was patient enough, but I'm not. And also... I don't even know where I was going anymore at that point because I'm too busy doing a sticker. I'm focusing so hard. <laughs> there, 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 there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's good. That's good shit. Do it. Fully. Ah. Come on. Yes. Ah. Yes. Oh, yes. That was peak ADHD right there. <laughs> Too busy doing a sticker so I couldn't finish my sentence. I don't even know what I was thinking. There. Yay. I think I need to open a new bag. Wait a minute. Oh, I kind of did like two steps at the same time, I see. Um, so this piece goes here with the little grabby arms in the middle. Oh, it must be the door hinge. And then one up top. And then one of these to close it off. Heck yeah. 
Woohoo! There. Yeah, you can see that this one's crooked, this little sticker, but these are really good. They're good straight on. Yeah, oh my god, they're kind of crooked. Don't look too long. Okay, now I need one of these for this little hole here. Claps aggressively. Thank you, Bunny. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't have to be perfect. I'm just happy that I got one of these and I'm allowed to make it. And it's going to be proudly displayed behind me after it's done. Plus, I like that this is like something that we normally don't do. We don't do these kind of creative streams. Um, ooh, we're gonna do the door hinge. I need like a little stick. Wow, in here. You go up there. I need these. Yeah, I need two of these and one little, yeah, this little gray thing. Okay, so, oh god, how do you do that? So it needs to go in. Oh, easy. <laughs> it's easy. And then down. Yeah, it needs to be down a little bit more. Yeah. And then this goes up top. I don't know if it's too high. I guess it's... Yeah, it's pretty even. Look, it's the little door hinge. <laughs> Ooh, round boy time. All these round boys. Oh, each corner as well. Okay. Where are they? Oh, here. Okay, this is gonna this is dangerous. These are gonna roll everywhere. Or not? Okay. Cool. I need to stack seven of them four times yeah seven times four 28 correct are they identical do they have a top or bottom oh yeah that's another thing my oh they do have a top or bottom oops there i'm gonna stand by again i need to move the mouse every now and then um i realized another thing my brother does that i that i really don't have an eye for but apparently they have like Whenever Lego pieces get made, they have like one tiny point somewhere. Yeah. I don't even know if you can see this on the cam. Oh, wow. Look at the zoom. See that little dot there? So that is where it gets snipped off, right? After it's made, like this is smooth and this will have a little dot. So my brother, when he makes his Lego, he also lines up all the dots on the inside. So you don't see it on the outside of the build. And when he started doing that, I was like, oh, you're all, you're like next level because I don't give a shit about that. I won't even see. That's hardcore. Yeah. <laughs> he is like with Legos the way I am with puzzles. Where I'm just like, I, I've realized that I can't really make puzzles with other people because I have my own way of doing it. Sorry, I have a little drippy. <laughs> I have my own way of doing it, so I can't really, um, when I do, when, when I see people puzzle another way or like just take a handful of pieces that they'll go through, then I'll just be like, no, I can't go through those pieces. So I can't, I, I don't puzzle well with others. Oh, but once you see it though, it's one of those things. When you, once you see the, the clip point, you can't unsee it. Like there, see those two up top? It's very faint. 
but you can see two little dots on the top ones. So I can I can totally understand that you would want to align them. <laughs> Once you see it, you can't unsee it. There. First one done. Three more to go. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Okay. And plant them. Touch down. Okay, now Dutch. Aim. Three. Three. Fear. Five. Sis. Zaven. Yes. What else can I do? Japanese. Last one, Japanese. Eat. Sun Shi Go Dok Nana. There we go. Awesome. I feel like if I push this too hard, they're all gonna spill apart. Okay, I need one more of these these. I think this is the, the top. Nice. That was easy. I did it. <laughs> oh yeah, we're making the top. See that? There's like little bits on the top. Like little... Oh, that's where you get the letter! Right! That's how you start the game. You open the letter on the that's on top of the box. Cool. Ooh, it's time for these. Now I want Legos. Yeah, you should really ask the devs to like release this because this is so fun. Remember when we finished the fourth room game? And there was a, a Lego plant of the whole dollhouse. That was so cool looking. I think I'm following that project, but I don't think it's funded. There, these are similar. These are the ones I need, actually. Maybe I should just put them on. Um... Oh, there's corner pieces, too, of these. So they go on like this. Oh. Okay. So these are the corner pieces. Um, I have one sister who also absolutely loved doing puzzles at grandma's. No, I've done. Wait. Oh, I'm on the wrong side. They need to be here. Oh, wait. How does this work? Oh, they. They stick out. Okay. So, yeah, these go along the length of the brick. And then this corner piece sticks out like that. Oh, that's cool. Okay. <laughs> Suddenly feels like I'm building Darth Vader. Um, but yeah, my other sister, who also is a big puzzler, she visited me. She visited me one time, and we made like three or four puzzles in a week, I think. And she's really serious with that, actually. Like I'm, I'm a casual puzzler. Um, I take my time, but she does like tournaments and stuff. She does like speed puzzling with a team. I was like, can I join your team? But her team's full. 
So I'm like a backup. If someone gets sick a day before a tournament, it'll be my time to shine. By golly. Yeah, it is very cool. It reminds me of... Um... Oh yeah, I wanted to recommend, actually, Karen. Um, I don't know if you've heard of Karen Puzzles. So she has a YouTube channel. Um, I, I love her. <laughs> I'm like a fan. But her channel is really fun if you're into puzzling. She collects... She's getting ready for the World Championship Speed Puzzling right now. Cool! I made a little platform. Um... But she also collects, like, just any kind of weird vintage puzzle that was ever released. And she hunts them down on, like, eBay and stuff. Um, it's so fun to watch. But yeah, her channel is called Karen Puzzles. If you, She's also really fun to follow on Instagram. Because then there she just, like, puts shorts up. Which I admittedly like a little bit more. I don't watch the full videos often. I am more of like watch the shorts and like see what kind of puzzles she buys. That kind of stuff. But I, she has a great channel. She's so fun. That one. That's like one. That's the YouTuber. Karen Puzzles is the YouTuber that I'm like, let me fly to wherever you live in the world. I will, I will fly over just so I could like puzzle with you. <laughs> Can we like collab and make a video together? That would be so fun. Um, these are cool pieces. Oh, look, it's a little umbrella. Yeah, she is. She's really fun, really positive, just fun channel. She really likes puzzling. She does these massive puzzles too. She buys like the biggest puzzles in the world, like that are like, I don't know, fucking 24K pieces. That That's where I draw the line. That's too big. I won't, I, 1K pieces is my preferred amount and I'll stick to it. I, I need more. Hmm. Where are they? Well, I have one flat one here. Oh! We don't have more. Okay. We need this... This one. Ah. Okay, okay. And then... Flat, 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 flat. This one. Cool, cool, cool. I got it. Nice. Okay, now I gotta do the edges. Oh yeah. We haven't used these in a while. And then the long slim bits from way in the start. Coming back into play. Cool. Oh, now I get it. So we're making the top right, and I was like wondering why those little indentations are in it. But that's because the the letter and stuff, the items that are on it, are going to be pinned into place. I see. Okay. Yeah, remember this little puzzle box? That's like on top. That's so cute. Okay, I need this one, I think. Yeah. And then this gold one. And two brown ones. Oh, and this is upside down, okay. How do they stick together? Yeah, these are identical. How did they... Do I have the wrong piece? Oh, I, I do have the wrong piece. That's the top piece. 
this piece is here. Oh, <laughs> it's like I made a little cake or something. <laughs> so cute. So that one goes here. <gasps> They're books! Oh, we're making books! That's what these are. These are book pieces. They're covers. Um, oh, this. Is it that one? I want to make sure I'm pushing the right piece together. I think so. Oh my god, that is so cute! I made a tiny book! <laughs> That's so cute! Okay, now we need to make another book. That's the top piece. There. <laughs> Two books. <laughs> This, the little white piece are the pages. I don't think we pin those in place. I think those just go like on top. Like you just position them however you like. And then the letter. That is so cute. That is awesome. Oh, now the whole thing goes on. So that's the front. Oh, this is scary. Oh, that's really scary. Because they're all they all need to align. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> oh, this could be a disaster. I'm trying to be so careful. I feel like if I squeeze too hard, it's gonna all come crumbling down. Oh, maybe if I do it upside down. Maybe I take these off for a sec. Maybe that's a bit better. Oh. <laughs> you got this? Ooh, I hope so. Well, I'm being very careful. Also a problem. I almost ooh, feel like I want to like take some stuff apart just so I can make it fit. Ooh, I think I got it. I got it on one side. It fits on one side. One of you. Oh, it fit on one side and now it came loose. I think it was the back that wasn't cooperating. Oh, yeah. I, there's one piece that wasn't in properly and I just pushed it in further. Let me just line them up properly. Hopefully. Um. That's the front. You are there. <laughs> okay. This I wish my brother was here and I could be like, you take it, you do it.
No oh, god. Maybe I'll take these off for a sec. Uh, actually no, then I can't put them in. These are precariously loose, these round boys. Okay. They're all good. I'll get it eventually. Yeah. Help me, brother! <laughs> Maybe Sean can help. I'm trying to see where they aren't aligning, but I can't see it. And it's hard as well because the top isn't flat, so I can't just like put them all against the desk. Hmm. Yeah, I can't really take the top apart either, anyway. Ooh, that's good. Okay. Oh. It was getting there and then it just popped out. I think I'm just being too careful, honestly. She said, moments before disaster. Ooh, I have one side. <gasps> yes, yes, yes. Yes, I got it. I got it. Oh my god, I got it. It's in. the letter back <laughs> that is so cute <laughs> okay we are back in business step 55 done okay is it just showing me where i should be at right now it's just showing me like a full status update we did it okay Putting this little thing on the back. I gotta be real careful now. I feel like if I squish this too hard, it's all gonna come crumbling. Oh god. Very carefully. Put a little nubbin on. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Remember how in the room you do the puzzle box and then you open it and then there's another puzzle box inside? We are literally making the Lego thing, the puzzle box in the puzzle box. Oi. Okay, we can do it. Okay, you got your piece. This goes in the middle. <laughs> it's a puzzle and a puzzle in it. Okay. There. <clears throat> These little two go here. Oops. There you go. All signed and sealed. Oh, it's those, um, the ones that I said had such a nice texture on the side. Those go on here. You know what's great about this Lego? It's really making me want to play the game again, and we are literally going to play the game after this. Makes me happy. Okay. And then we repeat the process. We add another layer. Oh, I didn't realize. Some have vertical, some have horizontal lines on them. Oh, it's just which way they're facing. Oh, cool. Smart. Okay, this one I just did right. And then it's 
time for these little boys. And these tiny boys. too hard. It's okay. Oh, no. Other way. There. All good. Just gotta keep my fingers on the bottom. There. Oh, that's a... That's a tip. That's a tip, isn't it? that. Hmm. Ah, there you are. <laughs> I can't believe we're making a tiny puzzle box for in the puzzle box. There, and then a little pyramid piece. Hee <laughs> hee. This looks like a little chocolate cake to me. Like a... Oh. Like a bonbon or something. Maybe I just have chocolate on the brain. <laughs> I totally forgot. I have a full cup of coffee here. <laughs> I let the entire cup of coffee go cold. Eh. So we put these all around. There we go. What a waste of a nice oat latte, huh? I mean, I'll still drink it, so it didn't technically go to waste, but the enjoyment factor is down by like 30%, you know? Maybe 50 We put these a little. Oh no, not yet. These. Oh yeah, these go on top. Bing, 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 bing. Hit. Hit. Oh, I didn't even put it on yet. Thought I did it. My nails are a little too long. There we go. And then the little top comes on. This will be so fun having made this now when once we play the game. It'll be like, oh yeah, there's the thing. That's the thing from the Lego we just built. Ain't I amazing? It's the thing from the thing. <laughs> And last one. There. Gold tips. Cute. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, now it has to go in. <laughs> oh dear god. Puzzle box. I know the lighting isn't great. Oh, there. If I if I do like this, the lighting comes in. It's in. That's very very cool. Okay, now these pieces. Oh, it's time for the little guy. He's coming. Oh, this looks scary. I need to do these things on the front of... Okay, so one 
here. hope so. Okay. Yep. Oh, we're making the, the vault door next. You have one piece. I do. Oh, I need to put stickers on. Oh, here we go. Absolutely perfect. All the edges are perfectly aligned. I did it. Okay, that was that one. Now I need to get this one. Will lightning strike twice? It will, and then it do. <laughs> I did it. Nice. Okay, so I need two little grabby arms. Two of these. Oh, right, they go on top of this. I was like, how is that all going to stick together? and text to me it maybe you'll see later tonight he'll be like you did a lego stream <laughs> i keep saying that it's not showing which way the stickers should be facing let me see if it says it on the other side nope oh okay okay so it should be inward The bottom is oh oops sorry the bottom is done okay so that was that one put this one on top come on can't be that hard there we go Oh, the whole ones in the middle. Eh. Okay, and then <laughs> the little guy. <laughs> These. Yeah. Okay. Nice. That's that. This one, okay, goes here. Oh god. Oh god. There. Uh, I need a weird little corner piece. Oh, there it is. Nice. Need these. Okay. And then I need another hooky thing. And another 
onesie. Oh, we're making good time now. Okay, sticker time. You hold the book for me. Wow. Oh, I just realized it even has the thing... You know how in the game, we'll see it in a bit, but the, the, the legs of the box, they have like the elements on it, and we have the stickers for those as well. See up there? That's great details. Perfect. I'm good at these for some reason. Applying these I can do. Shouldn't have said that. Now I'm gonna mess it up. Okay, and this one goes on like this. Oh, I should do it like that then. Yes. <laughs> These little stickers are bringing out the gremlin. Okay. One of these on top, like that. I want these. Okay, A little flat boy, and now the stickered ones. But let me just check. Make sure they're all facing the right way. Oh, I almost had a panic attack. <laughs> I was like, I put the sticker on wrong, but I did. I did it right. Yeah. Beautiful. Um, let's see. So that's that done. Flat top piece. That's the last one of the flat ones. Okay. I need two of these? Oh. I have a tall and a short one. There. And then this piece comes here. That's so cool. <laughs> okay. These weird little round pieces go in now. Ah! <clears throat> Got it. <laughs> it's like a little doorknob. Oh, he has a little hat. <laughs> he gets a little hat. Okay. Uh, another knob on this end. Come on. Get in there. Doesn't have to be this hard. Okay. Um, and then these things go in the middle. Wow, this is so cool. Cool. Now the front goes on like that. Oh, I just remembered another thing. You know how these pieces have like a Lego printed on them? It's probably hard to see, but they say Lego in the little nubbins. 
my brother also lines up all the Legos straight up. So all the Lego... Um, so this would be wrong in his eyes because the Legos need to be facing up properly. So like that. <laughs> it does look better once you really... I think if you do, if you do enough Lego, you get really particular about that kind of stuff. Oh, I need to put a sticker on this. Oh, that's hard though. Round sticker is hard because you can't line up the sides properly. I also don't know how much edging there is. Maybe something like that. No. It needs to be right on the side. So cool. This is so cool. Okay, we have to put it in now. Um, hmm. Is it like that? No, it's like that. Hmm. That's a little tricky. Oh god, that's pretty pretty hard. the door. I think I did it! Oh, we need to do the legs next. Yeah, the cute little leggies. Wow, it actually fits. Oh. Is it supposed to do that? Oh god, I don't know. Panic! Yeah, I think it can close. I'm not gonna tempt fate, but I think you can close it properly as well if you want to. I think this bar needs to go a little higher. There. Oh, yeah, I think that's it. I think I... I think I, the top I did correctly, but the bottom, the legs don't really match up, so that's why it doesn't click shut perfectly. Leggy time. So, leggy time means sticky time. So these four are gonna get stickers. Okay. These are tiny. That's a tiny sticker. Look how tiny it is compared to my thumb. <laughs> Okay. No, dear God. Oh, perfection. Okay, that's one. That's pretty good. Hmm. 
No, that one was so quick. What? <laughs> How'd I do that? <laughs> Dear God, please help me in this time of need. <laughs> <laughs> Last one. That was surprisingly easy. Wow. Look at that. Beautiful. Okay, so... Uh, okay, so if the door's here... I was holding it upside down. The door's like that. The leggies go outward. Can't even read it. Earth and fire go on that side. Okay. So earth goes here. Fire. Cool. Very cool. It looks so legit. <laughs> His little leggies. And then the other side. Oh, they don't even say which element goes on the other side. I guess it doesn't really matter. There we go. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> oh, and now we stick it on. So this little thing goes on the front. Wow, that is so dope. I'm so happy I got this. That is so cool. We're making something else. I think it's another puzzle box. Like a tiny one. So I have one of those. Let me move the mouse before it goes into standby again. Okay. How? What is this magic? What do I do? One there. One on the side. And uh, I need a flat boy out here. And then this one is like behind it. I don't know. I don't think they attach yet. Oh, and then this one goes connects them in a bit. That looks like I missed a step. Weird. Oh, this looks so weird. Okay. Um... Oh. I think it's telling me I just need to mirror this. So like that, and then one of these on the other side. Um, do I have another? I do not. Ooh, are we through all of our bags actually? I didn't even realize we emptied all of the bags. These are like the last pieces. Oh, I see now. We're not supposed to put like a one on. It's a wide one. Okay, so this goes like that. This one goes on top. 
And then another white one goes here. Single piece goes there. And another single piece goes here. Sniffly sniffly. Ah. <sighs> Oh, it's just a like a like loose set piece, and this is one as well. But I think this one gets like gets to go on. Oh, it doesn't have to be straight on though. Oh, <laughs> I took the whole piece off. <laughs> Oops. I think it's like that. Yeah, okay. Oh, wait. No, no, no. It goes here. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Oh my gosh, do you know what this is? <laughs> Remember the umbrella? <laughs> <laughs> it's just an umbrella stand and the hat goes here <laughs> uh, the newspapers go here and on the other side there's newspapers there oh we get to make the little guy Finally. It says he gets a- Oh! There's another hat! Oh, now he's a proper top hat. That's so cool. Look at this little guy! He's ready for an adventure. He's looking for the null element. And then in one hand, he gets a key. Oh, that's scary. There. That's a big key. That's a big key, brother. And then... A candle in the other hand. Oh, they don't fit. Hmm. Yeah, that doesn't fit. Or is it... No, it doesn't fit on either. Oh, unless it goes in the tiny side. Oh, maybe that's it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it. Oh, <laughs> look how big that candle is for him. <laughs> but now he has a little key. And a little candle. <laughs> and he gets to stand right here. That is so cute. Oh my god, it's really coming together now. Oh, this is a... Oh, that's a sticker too. Ow! Oh, that's it. This is the last page. So, this... The room is a sticker that goes on here. Okay, how much space we got? Not a lot. I don't think it's gonna do it. Maybe should align it on the top. Oh, there's a cat hair on it. This is true goblin mode right here. Peak goblin potential. Oh yes. 
say today? <sighs> Yay! <laughs> I got a little sign up front. Oh, something fell. Oh, the hat. Wait, where did it go? Did you guys see it? The hat fell somewhere, but... I don't know. It's done! That is so dope. Keyboard? <laughs> okay, thanks. So... I can't really... There. Because I want to show it with the right lighting. I guess I could just put it down. And then the books... We can put, like, here. Oh yeah, and this thing goes, like, here. So this is the full... the full thing. That is so cool! That is absolutely amazing. And then this opens up to reveal some stuff is gonna fall. Yeah, there you go. Another puzzle box inside. So dope! How long did it take us to make that? Two hours? Huh, that's not too bad. My brother is going to be so jealous. <laughs> there. Awesome. Ah, oh, that's so cool. Now that you've seen the Lego, let's play the game. <laughs> um, let me go full screen first. Now I can shut off this second cam. And I forgot to install the game. I knew I was forgetting something. Um, <laughs> it'll only take a second though. So yeah, the room is actually on sale right now. If you haven't played it yet, oh my god. I recommend it. They're really, really fun. I'll show. I Honestly, I think we can finish the whole game in like an hour and a half think so we might even finish the first game today but there are five games total there's one for vr um but yeah 10 10th anniversary they're super super cool they're fun on ios they're on nintendo switch they're on sale you can get them so cheap right now i think what did i say earlier let me check 85 percent off on the UK shop, on the UK Nintendo eShop, 80% off in the US until September 22nd. Um, on Steam, 60% off. Google Play Store, 75% off. They're really... Oh, it's already installed. <laughs> really, really worth it. So cheap right now. Super fun games. Ooh. Hee hee hee! Let me turn down the volume a little bit. Something like that? That's probably good. Oh my god. There it is! Oh my god, look! <laughs> Click and drag to look around. That's it! Oh wait, I gotta... <laughs> Let me just take the stuff off that falls off. Ooh. It's the box. <laughs> that is so cool. <laughs> Even the sign is on the back. Oh, it keeps wanting to focus on my face. And then the top. There's the books and the envelope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
<laughs> that is so fun. Okay, there. Double click on the envelope. You came. I knew your curiosity would get the better of you. Please excuse m the mess. My housekeeper abandoned me shortly after the rest of the world. The answers you seek are inside this box, along with something else. Something they said could never be built. It is the only one in existence, and it is the key to incomprehensible power. This safe was constructed to keep it from lesser minds. I have every faith in you solving its mysteries. You always were the smart one. With the enclosed key, I give you one parting favor. Keep this eyepiece with you always. Without it, you are as blind as the rest. The stakes are higher than you could possibly imagine. A small brass key with an animal motif. Hee <laughs> hee. Ah, oh, yes. Curious eyepiece. Feed me and I shall survive. Give me drink and I shall die. It doesn't do anything. Perhaps something's missing. What does the note say? Oh yeah, don't we need to find the lens? Double click to focus on the note. Fire? Feed me and I shall survive. Give me drink and I shall die. Is it fire? Oh, is it maybe the fire on the foot? Water? Air, fire. Oh, what did, oh, there, yeah! A peculiar old key. There's something unusual about this key. I should take a closer look. Looks like I can turn the end to make the key into a different shape. Okay. Can I move that? Oh! Uh, okay. We need, like, the little horns on the side. Oh, I can only do it two ways. Maybe that then. Nope. <laughs> oh, oops. There. Try that. Ah, I applied those stickers. <laughs> We still need to find the lens, right? Because I think we need to... Yeah. Seems to rotate, no markings. I need to look elsewhere. What do your elven eyes see? Ooh, there's another one here. <laughs> An ornately engraved metal plate. The end looks like it could be used as a wrench. Okay, find the wrench bit. Could it be that? Aha! The lens. Oh, yeah! Here we go! It's so cool! does it say on the back there in the window can't really see okay I can't rotate the center oh oops there here it goes Ha <laughs> ha There it is! <laughs> we just made that! Well, well, let's take it out for a closer look. So fun. <laughs> there it is. It's in there. <laughs> Uh, these three seals stand between me and the contents of this box. Okay, I remember I can rotate one of these legs. 
A short piece of cotton. Smells of paraffin. Mm hmm. Five. Two up there. See that? Two. Five, two, seven. Six. Is that a six? Five, two, seven, six. Yeah, that's probably it, right? Five, two, seven, six. And that thing. Oh, I see. Uh, five, two, seven, six. Oh, God, I love these games so much. Uh, Sean and I went through a phase of these games and we played all of them in like, I think four nights. Yeah, so one every night. February 11th. My research continues at a snail's pace. With these barbaric instruments, I can barely read anything at all, but there is something there. Between earth and fire, between water and air. I cannot see it, but I can see its presence, like the shadow of the object without substance, yet betraying the shape and form of what that which casts it. It is the final element, null. It brings meaning to the rest, just as all the numbers of the world are meaningless without their zero. The circle are pretty f petty fools, blinded by their dark arts and their greed. Alchemy is not the pursuit of callow gold. It is the pursuit of this. One of seven. Hmm. A little lippy break. I do know about the VR one, yeah. I just It's just a lot of effort to set it up. Okay, there's no... Um, so I haven't actually played that one, no. Mm -hmm. Up you go. Okay, so that works. But we need the lens, I think. And a winding mechanism. There's another one. There are two round cylinders. Oh, a star. Let's look at those cylinders. Ah, telescope. Ooh. Oh, we're missing a thingy. Missing a letter. Align that. Hee <laughs> hee. Can we put it in? Nice. Um. There's nothing to see until I got it got the contraption working. Okay. So we still need more. There's got to be something in here too. There's something here. Oh, fingerprints. Ah. A book. The cover seems very ornate. Aha! <gasps> the winding key! Can we read that? My research continues... Oh, wait, oh, this is the one we read. Okay. Then we're good. So we needed the winding key... here? Is it working? Let's go! Yes! So dope! I get the feeling there's more to that than I saw. Would the eyepiece reveal anything? Trial. 
That's the box. So cool. Four was your favorite? I think four is my favorite too. The dollhouse. Cool. Hee <gasps> L. Where was trial? Ah, here. <laughs> trial. Twile. Trial. Tr tro troll. Troll. Troll in a dungeon. That you would like to know. Ah, one of the seals opened. Two more and I'm in. Hoo hoo hoo. Okay. May 8th. McAllister returns with the rubbings. Rubbings? Rubbings from Egypt. The pattern continues. The Tibetan Tibetans call the null element space. To the Hindus, it's the ether. And now to the Babylonians, it is simply up, the other direction, the realm of Ishtar. Of yet more significance is the recurring presence of the hex hexagonal glyph. Hexag yeah, hexagonal. The same symbol repeated in cultures separated by countless centuries in the span of the globe. Who will tell me now what this is, that this is idle superstition at work? When my hands hold the first distilled sample, they will recognize me then. Presently, the skeptics have one more in their number. McAllister has quit my service. Oh. Two. Five. Two and five. What this? Can't open it. Okay. Hmm. Nothing in our inventory. Nothing in my hands. Nothing in my hands. <laughs> oh yeah, we have these things. Squiggly thing, top right. That one. Yeah. Oh, and here, crown, bottom right. And then we saw one on the inside somewhere. There. The double line. Oh wait, was it top or bottom? Bottom. This one. So where's the last one then? Oh there, the round one. Aha! A heavy cast iron key. Right shape, but the hole isn't tall enough. So it's not open yet. Oh, oops. Looks like we can't manipulate any of it. One, two. It's a safe dial, but there's a piece missing. Okay. I've played these games many times, <laughs> but it's always like, if enough time passes, I'm always like, I don't remember. I could keep playing these games forever and ever. Like, I remember some specifics, like I remember that leg. And I remember, when in doubt, you just gotta use the lens. But this time, I'm not seeing anything. Anyone remember? We got the key. We 
We can't get in there quite yet. We did that. Ah! Ooh! Hmm. I can't move them though. Oh, I can move this. Oh. Thank God they stopped moving altogether. There. Yeah. Oh. Yes, I love this stuff. So cool! I love the perspective puzzles. They're so fun. Okay, a keyhole. Oh, well, I have a key. Oh, that was how it was being held closed. Another key! A small cabinet key. <gasps> a star. Isn't it crazy how this game is 10 years old now? And it still plays so well. Like, this game... I know- I think they did a remaster of it. Like, they updated the graphics at one point, but... It definitely still plays really well. June 21st. Take note of this date. It is the most significant in human history. I have done it. A human subject was required. The catalyst was my own being. Fatigued by my studies, I entered the chamber without disabling the mechanism. When I regained consciousness, I had succeeded. The null element is beyond curious, being neither quite energy nor matter. I have already made great strides in its study, specifically in how to in how it refracts the light. Tonight, I open the wine. Oh, I want wine. Oh, I didn't realize I grabbed that. A brass ring. Um. Hmm. That is for something, but I don't remember where. Is there something in here? No. It feels like there's something supposed to be in there. Oh! It's for this. One, two, one, two, three, four, five? No. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, two and five it was, right? Ho ho ho! <laughs> and then we take that baby here. Um, okay, I can't turn the key. So, one arm up, one leggy out. Okay. Hmm. Maybe like that? Nope. Oh! Is that new? I don't remember it doing that. Oh, these are... Oh, no, yeah. So... Oh. Eh. Am I straight on or not? I can't tell. Hmm. Oh, I can move it. Oh! So this one is perfect. This is the problem child. There. That must be it. Yeah. Circular plate with a star emblem. Another star? 
Not on there, right? Square indentation. Oh, that must be here. Oh, another one bites the dust. Nice. We need a big... We need a coin. <laughs> okay, we have a arrow drawn on the thing on the front. But I can't actually turn it. Okay. Oh, this is a lot to look at. Oh, here's another one. Hmm. Up you go. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. I remember, I remember. Okay, so you need to be like that. Uh, this one is bottom right, so we'll put this here. And then we saw another one up top. So your bottom left. So we just need to find the triangle now. Have we seen the triangle anywhere? Are you behind here? <laughs> Was that it? Yeah. Hello. A large cog. Hey, nice cog. An elastic band. Can't fit it there. Ah. Nice. Screwdriver. Ee wee wee. Ee wee wee. Ee wee wee. Ee wee wee. There we go. What do I do? Oh. Oh, it's a key. Not for here, right? What do we do with this? Do we stack certain ones? Maybe at the bottom? Hmm. Let's see, what else we got? An elastic band. We can't move these, can we? I remember this elastic band going somewhere. But not there. Maybe we need to find more cogs. Hey, look at this! So you go up top. And then up and down. Up and down. Oh, so they need to be mirrored. So you go there. You guys go there. <gasps> it's another cog! Well, I can put that to use right here. Oh, that one can go come off. Haha. <laughs> okay, so now we need to make this work. Oops. Yeah, I knew it. I remembered that one. Yes. Aha! What that? Steel tube. <clears throat> Anything else here? Hmm. 
Now what would we need a steel tube for? If you were a steel tube, where would you go? There's something on it. Oh! Small key. Old photograph. The house! Yes! A uh, tiny keyhole here. How do we look at this? Oh, I'm getting closer. <laughs> or not. <laughs> Need to use that back wall somehow, right? Ooh, ooh, ooh. There. That's it? Yeah, okay. Excuse me. Small shield. Silver. Who wants it? You're gold, though. Oh, never mind. Oval gemstone. If you were an oval gemstone, where would you go? <laughs> Maybe here? I can turn it now. Where do we turn it to? Oh! We need a time. Is there any time on this? Oh! 6.05! I was almost there! <laughs> two done I think ooh so pretty yes oh big table so cool mm. ooh switches let's go well that didn't do much oh what's that Um, a square hole. Hmm. Anything in here? Hmm. Can't open it yet. Oh, I remember these. These are little buttons, right? Yeah. <laughs> I remember. Hey, our weird key. Can I slide this? <laughs> July 15th. My research into the null element continues at pace. Given the nature of its origins, I am increasingly convinced that it is somehow tied to my very soul. Its properties are becoming clear. It derives a colossal energy from somewhere. I have fashioned a device through which to channel and focus it, but I am fearful of fur further experimentation. I lack the understanding to control it. That's it. That's the symbol. So cool. Who's whispering in my ear? Here we go. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Hmm. 
That one doesn't fit anywhere. Haha! -ha. Ooh, pretty key. Thank you. Now, where does this key go? Hmm? Oh, I remember this. Oh, I can't wait to show you guys. Oh, I can't turn that yet. Wasn't there like one of these that was different? No, it must be later. I think there's a handprint somewhere that we can start with. Or not. We did that one. Never mind. Where does the key go? Where's the keyhole? This one? Oh, yeah. I remember this. Okay, five versus four. square peg. Anything else here? It's a frame for a piece of paper. Ooh, okay. Oh, like the picture we have? Yes! Oh my god, so cool. Sigil. Fucking dope. So cool. The square thing we got is like this. Oh, but this is way. Maybe it goes down there. Hmm. Can't drag it. There we go. Ah. Aha. Sigil. A new discovery has shaken me to my core. To investigate the refractive properties of the null element, I fashioned lenses from it. To wear one is troubling and exhausting in equal measure, and I am shown visions that are beyond my co comprehension. The visions turn darker the deeper into the earth I go. I have relocated my study to the North Tower. I can no longer visit the wine cellar. Ooh! So cool! Now this crystal goes in one of these cavities it's somewhere here oh maybe down there yeah go in there now beam me up yeah and concentrate the beam there it goes <laughs> a weighted flywheel what is that? What does it fit into? Oh, a plus. Okay. Hmm. We have some pluses here, but I don't think that's it. Have I done this? Should focus on the sides for now. Oh, thank you. Thank you for letting me know. I'm overlooking it. It's probably just somewhere. You guys see it? It's not one of these, is it? No. What's this down here? Oh, that's it. 
<laughs> sort of device for, reflect, for reflecting light. Thank you. Do you see those hinges there? There's something up with this. Hmm. Uh, hello. You. Oh, nice. I gotta zoom in here and then. Yeah. Square pin. I've seen a square thing somewhere. Anyway, this goes here, I think. Hee <laughs> Ah, there. Nice. Okay, we don't really know what to do with that yet, I think. Oh, here it comes again. But how? From which way? Do I turn this? Oh. Oh, mama. An intricate wooden box. Can I open it? Hmm. Yeah, I think... Yeah, this is like something... We need to like go around multiple things, but I forget what we do exactly. Um, a little box. Does it, does it go up top? No. Hmm. The music. Okay, that reset it. And another one opens. Aha! A brass key. That was it. Music being creepy over here. <laughs> Oh yeah, I like this one. Um, hmm. Oh yeah, I can do that too. Hmm. There's one more here as well. don't know where it needs to reach. Hmm. Ooh, that's a good one. Oh, look at that. There it goes. Oh. I want it. Wow. <laughs> so cool. Thank you. Part of South America. Here you go. Hmm. Okay, we still have our strange box. I wonder if it fits 
here. Can we like unfold some of these? Oh. Ah. There you go. <laughs> I still got it. Right, okay. One, three, two, one, three, four. One, three, two, one, three, four. One, three, two, one, three, four. Thank you. The circle were right all along. How can I have been so blind? I have discovered a passage in their scriptus nocti, an incantation lacking the energy source to drive it. Well, I have such a source. This night I summon Astaroth, whom the Babylonians called Ishtar, prince of accusers and inquisitors, and he who can discover all secrets. Once correctly bound, all knowledge of the null element can be mine. I can barely contain myself. There is much to prepare. Like this piece of the globe! <laughs> okay. Did this, did that, did this. This bit is done. I think it's time for the top. Can I do this one? Nope. Still need to do sides. What could it be? We need one more piece of the globe. What did I miss? Timer button? Do the little square thing. <laughs> the little square thing. We did do the top though. We can't do those anymore. We did the lasers. Oh wait. Oh, is this the other side? Oh. So I did the left side and now I need to do the right side. Ah, to bed, I think. There. There it goes. We're done with the planet. Oh, yeah. Now release another Lego <laughs> of this. I'll make it. <laughs> I could <can> do it. <laughs> Ah, so cool. Okay, now can I do this? Those line up now. Oh, wait, I didn't even see that. Something is wrong. I followed the incantation to the very letter. Astaroth did not appear. There are no answers to be had. More questions. The visions have increased. They gather to me and I cannot stay in one place for long. I try to monitor them, but the lens hurts my eyes. I have mixed the solution for the pain. For those that follow and find this journal, I lack the power to describe this. There is no concept within the human sphere with which to explain it. The house is so much larger now. There are rooms everywhere. A button here. Boink. No. Can't drag it. The center. A small slit in the exact center of the table. What can we wind up? Do you think it's something down again? No, I think we're like up top now, right? That center is round. Hmm. Oh, maybe here? A large circular indentation. Can't zoom on that one. Hmm. Oh. Huh. 
What does that mean? Oh. Haha. -ha. A small socket. Stop right there. Ah, oh, I just had to move it a little further. <laughs> Tiny little dog. There you go! <laughs> I'll help you out. It's the sword! <laughs> Can we turn it? Can we turn the center of the table? Not yet, I think. Do you think we can do it? I don't think so. I think we need to turn the sword. Oh, can I? Oh, I can! Ornate ancient dagger. God, so cool. There they go. Lots of buttons. I forget what we need to do. Is it a certain pattern? Hmm. Can we do this again? No. It is a pattern, isn't it? Isn't it something in the background? Something we can see. <gasps> there. Okay. Was it this? Two, two, and two. It is. Right? Seeing eye. Oh, there's another pattern. Hi. Hi. What's up? Not much. <laughs> I'm pretty much done with the game. Already? Yeah. Damn. We're getting close to it. You can join if you want to play a bit. <laughs> you just came in for a kiss? <laughs> no, it's pretty good. <laughs> there. Oh, now they've stopped. I see. Ooh. Can we, we can't still. Oh, I see. I need to probably turn it here now. Can I? Hmm. No, it stopped at a certain angle. More than an angle. So this is the center. Yeah! Got it. <gasps> a large golden amulet. Oh! Big circular thingy. I know where you go. Oh, the dagger is back. Oh. Now it's aligned at the other arrow. 
โอ้One bottom part that doesn't move. Ah. Yes. And now I put it on top. Pushing. <laughs> so cool. Sense of movement, not quite turning, not quite falling. I felt myself cross the threshold, and the visions abated. Perhaps they only serve to drive me to this place. The route back closes behind me, but a way forward opens ahead. Something is drawing me on. In case you are with me, I will try to guide you along the path. I pray you never came. I pray you're just another of my dreams. Would that be B and F? Yeah, probably. BF. Okay. Mhm. Mm I thought that last one was the end of the game. I guess I misremembered. Ooh, one, two, three. Aha. Shoot.
There's a gear missing, I see. Uh, this is also for a little later. Oh, look at this. There's the handprint that I remembered. Oh, what do we do? <gasps> Another button. Hoo hoo. A small gear. Thank you. I guess I'll put it in here and push this button. Okay, so this is like it, yeah. Okay, it turns that. And how do we turn that thing? Wait. Oh, I did one now, so now it reset. Oh, I see, but they close if I... Uh-huh. Yeah, big brain! Hi. A metal orb, something strange about it. What you got in there? Nothing. <laughs> oh. oh, there it is. A button. Oh, hey. Eh. Grab it. <laughs> eh. <gasps> Open it. <laughs> Why can't I open it? It keeps closing. <laughs> Stay open. There you go. Yeah, yeah there we go. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I finally got it. Here you go. It was a drawer all along. Ah, the key! The the bit the, the tarot cards. There they are! That's so cool. Wait, how? Let's find the death card. See how exactly the same it is. Nah, -ha -ha. Wow. Yeah, that's amazing. There it is. That is so cool. <laughs> I'll keep them here in case we find some more. Old faded tarot cards. Okay. Star shaped thing. Oh. The gears are churning. Oh. What did I just disconnect? I rubbed my feet along the floor. <laughs> and I got like static electricity and then. Doo -doo -doo. Oops. I don't know what I did. Isn't it something like I turn the key and then... Yeah. And then now if I turn it again, there's like an open compartment. This way. Uh-huh. And then I gotta do that again for the other one. Oh, 
I got both. Um, anything else here? Ooh, keyhole. Oh, I do have a key. What do we do here? Oh. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> There's this as well. One, two, three. Triangles. Ah. <laughs> it looks like Japanese hiragana. Ah. And S. Ass. Hmm. Does this go here? Oh. <gasps> BF. Looks like a coin slot. Hmm. Nothing else? Hmm. Guess it's gotta wait a little bit. Oh, and there's these things as well. But how do we <clears throat> manipulate these? It's triangle. Oh. Ah. So. As. Was it that one? <clears throat> uh -huh. Aha. Doesn't say on it. Talisman curios. Roller organ token. Hmm. Wait, do I need to mimic it? I see. <laughs> I've had that music stuck in my head. A metal handle. Two metal handles. Yeah, ever since... <clears throat> every time I was in contact with Fireproof Games about the box and stuff, I my head was just like... <laughs> do you think these... What do they look like? Oh, hexagon. Hmm, hexagon. Where do you want to go? That's just the thing closed, right? Yeah. <clears throat> if you were a hexagon, where would you go? There's nothing under the table, right? We didn't figure this out, though. Mm -mm, yeah. And I did this part. We did this part. Unless... Yeah, we can't open it again. Nothing there. I do know this top box opens as well, but what was it again? Use the key to turn the handles. I can't turn that. It has a three in it. <coughs> But it's an icon on it that's not in here. 
I should I made that I made that drink and then never drank it. Hmm. One, two, three. Oh. Oh, look at that. So is that just giving us the answers? So <clears throat> left and right. Maybe we should take a picture. Just in case, you know. Um What if I move it? So now it's on the left, which is this one. Does that help us then if we turn it again? Oh, and then maybe doing it this way. Oh, I see. This one. Okay, those moved. That's still that, okay. But maybe if we turn it again? Oh! -ho. Buttons! Numbers? Oh, right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, so this is the bottom part. So they need to match up with the top part that doesn't move. Oops. Hmm. Maybe that's seven? That's a three for sure. Five seven three. Five seven three. <gasps> oh, haha. -ha. Now what? <laughs> Do we turn it? At all? There's a box in it. Oh, what was this again? Oh, dear lord. Okay. Oh, so wait. If I turn this now, like that... And I think this is open. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got it, I got it, I got it. I remember. Okay, so do that and then bring that over. It's the same one, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. But. Uh, hmm. Oh yeah, that's the same one. Like that? Oh! Okay, now I need to do the bottom ones. So that's one there. Now, bottom left, okay. Those are done, right? 
that's the empty one. Okay, so this one needs to be... I said bottom right? I think if I... Wait, let me just check. Oh, yeah, bottom left. Okay. But bottom right from this side. Okay. Mm. So I have this guy here. That's the same one, isn't it? Yeah. How do I rotate it? Mm. Come on. Come on, little handle. Maybe it's like a quarter kind of thing. Yes. Yeah, baby. Rubik's Cubal. <laughs> Rubik's Cubal. <laughs> Rubik's Cube. <laughs> oh no, it's a Rubik's Cubal! <laughs> Whoa, I twisted in my hand. It doesn't like when you make jokes about it. Open up. Oh, right, right, right. I remember. We need to bring these down because then I can take them out here. Yeah. Okay. There. Okay, now it's gonna get a tiny bit tricky because we need to make some space, but it's not too bad. <gasps> There we go. And then we put them in this thing. I don't know what I do after that. Is it a certain... Certain order they need to be in? Oh, maybe if we look through the glass. Oh. What is that? Whoa. They probably fit into each other, right? In some way. Green, yellow, blue. Let's swap those. I don't know if I actually swapped them now. Did that change? Oh, we're making this thing. Ah, I see. So... Let's move blue. Let's swap these. Oh, blue is matching up with green now, isn't it? But red can only be in that one position. I don't know if I actually swapped them, though. I can barely see their colors. Oh! Is it getting a little better? So, let's put yellow here. No, no, no. Okay, so maybe blue in the back. Maybe swap green and blue. Hmm. It's... The blue is looking better there. Yellow up front. 
green in the back. Yeah. There we go. Figured it out. Took me a little bit. Shum. Hello. Little puzzle box. go. Do we turn this thing or which part do we turn? Ah. Okay, so there's only a couple positions. Before it cycles back. Over there. Uh, oh, blue jam. Oh. up just now. Ooh, do I want this way or do go this way? Hmm. Oh, I want this way actually. Haba. Hmm, <clears throat> it's so pretty. Oh, oops. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, mm, what are we trying to mm, mimic? Ah, there. Perfect. No, here it comes. Oh, yeah, I forgot the lens broke. This is uh <laughs> This is us by the way. <laughs> Come on. Go. Yeah. <laughs> this is us going through the game with the key. <laughs> game complete. Awesome. Ah, oh, that was so fun to play again. These games are amazing. You made it through, unflustered, I hope, as there will surely be sterner tests to come. We have taken the first step on a longer journey. I see no benefit in hiding the truth of your predicament. There is no way back, not for any of us. For now, you are as trapped as I. Press forward with heart, my friend. There are many more rooms ahead. Bling, 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 bling. <laughs> so fun to revisit. These games are so good. I really like these. I'm very excited that hopefully at some point we'll get um, the sixth game. We can only hope. But yeah, this is to let everyone know that the game is 10 years old right now, 10th anniversary. We did this awesome Lego today. I'm so happy they sent me this. This was so fun to make. Really, really cool. And the, the awesome cards. The tarot cards, oh my god. I want to frame some of these, I think. I think that would be really cool if I can get like a grid thing and just like frame a couple together. I think that would be awesome. Yeah, really cool. Um, the games are on sale right now to celebrate ten the 10th anniversary. On sale on the Google Play Store, on Steam, uh, Nintendo Switch as well. I can really recommend the iOS version and the Switch version because the touchscreen is really fun to do uh, plays really well but on steam as you could just as you just saw on steam they're totally fine to play as well if you if you prefer playing on pc 
Um, sales everywhere, massive sales, like 80, 85 percent. I'm not kidding. Go get them. Um, also, they sent me a little tidbit that was fun that the the game actually won Game of the Year on Apple, BAFTA for British Game, GDC Award for Best Mobile Game, and the TIGA TIGA Award for Best Game Design. Well worth it, I think it shows that this game is now 10 years old and we still is so good. So fun. But yeah, that'll be it for today. I I this sponsor stream was blessed. <laughs> I feel so spoiled. The fact that I get to make this little custom Lego and get all these goodies. And it, the games are just so fun anyway. Really, really cool. Um, but yeah, and if you are interested in maybe getting this Lego version for yourself, definitely poke the devs. Maybe they can make it happen um, that you can get your own Lego as well. Or the cards, tarot cards. Who knows? Definitely give them a poke. Give them a nudge um, if you're interested. Let me just quit this. That was so fun to play again. I love these games. Really cool. So cool. I hope you guys had a good time. Nice little chill puzzle day. Puzzle as in Lego and then puzzle game. <laughs> um, since we're on YouTube right now, it's a little weird mix in the credits of like, I think we get Twitch notifications in here and YouTube notifications eventually. I'm not Sure, I think subscriptions in this case are like YouTube subscriptions and then members are separate. I think, but I'm not sure. Such a cozy time. Yeah, super fun. It was really late. It really, I late. I saw someone say, no, I'm late. So my brain said late. It was really fun. Yeah, but it is a little late. It's 7 p.m. I'm hungry. Go and get some food. There, members. Thank you so much, everyone who became a member today. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Don't forget, you can um, use the emotes, but also join the Discord server. You should just connect um, your YouTube with your Discord account in your integration settings, your connection settings, and then my server should pop up there. Um, but thank you so much, everyone. It was awesome. Super fun. Uh, this will not be edited. This will just stay as the YouTube stream. That's why I wanted to stream on YouTube. So the VOD will stay up permanently um, over Twitch. But I did. I wasn't going to edit it or anything. Um, it's just going to stay up like this. So for anyone who wants to watch the Lego stream and just chill, you can. It'll just stay up. Um, but this lit, this is it for today. I'm hoping I can stream again soon for maybe Under the Waves. Maybe do that first, finish that up. I said it yesterday, but I already forgot what the plan was exactly. But we'll definitely do Nancy Drew again soon as well. And Fay Farm. Oh, did you guys see the announcement? Uh, Resi 4 Separate Ways um, is coming out next week. <laughs> they just dropped that on us yesterday. So um, I'll definitely, I think I'll record it. I think I'll try and just release it as a one-off for YouTube. So I think I'll record it or do a YouTube stream. <sighs> oh, I don't know. Maybe YouTube stream. But yeah, I, I was thinking I might just record it in a couple sessions and then release it as one video. So that that is my plan, I think. But yeah, we are getting separate ways on Thursday next week. So I'll definitely get on top of that. Uh, not on the day probably, but like a day or two later, we'll have like separate ways up on YouTube, I think. So lots of plans, busy, busy week next week. Um, and excited for it. Thanks so much for hanging out everyone today. I'll see you later. Thanks so much. It was fun.